but let's go to the Ashanti region, where a suspect in the gruesome murder of a young lady at Pokoso in Kumase has been linked to the death of two other women whose bodies were found in the area earlier this year. 27-year-old Samira Farouk was brutally murdered by the suspect who residents believe could be behind series of murder in the area. Nana Bonsu is believed to have lured his victims, mainly prostitutes, to his hideouts and succeeded in robbing and in some cases killing them. Lava Femme's Erasta Sasaridonko was in the community two days after the incident and now reports. The Pakoso town is shaken by the gruesome murder of a 27-year-old mother of two. These two carpenters got wind of the crime, chased down the suspect and arrested him. She was screaming. Ah, ah, ah. And I saw the young man throwing bricks at something three times. For a moment, I thought it was a snake until I saw his clothes soaked in blood. We rushed in, chased him, and arrested him. The victim was later identified as Samira Farouk and a mother of two. <laughs> Omar Farouk is her father. I don't know. I mean, hospital. There are conflicting reports on the condition of the suspect, whether dead or alive. If this were to be a lawless state, we would have lynched him as well. But we have laws. And I want justice. As her friends seek justice for her, residents of Pakoso, where she was killed, want a probe into the death of other women whose bodies were found under a canopy of trees a few meters from the suspect's home. Two months ago, I found the body in a coy. The name of the Pakura, the forest in the moor. Barely two months ago, a body was picked from that forest. We hear stories of women being stabbed and killed here. He's a criminal, and with his latest act, we believe he's behind these killings. We are scared. You can't use this road after 6 p.m. He robs people of their belongings on this road, close to the forest. He was arrested once and given some hot slaps. If he's the one behind these crimes, then it's a bad thing. Now we are told that all the bodies found in this canopy of thick trees were women. I have with me here uh, somebody who has stayed here for some time and has been part of the local watchdog committee. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Yeah, Jumano, I work community, no. And it's a multi me my SNB. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm going to go. Now I'm going to team. Am I targeting Baya? We should have a watchdog committee to improve security here. If only authorities will register and give us ID cards. We are volunteering. We are ready to work to boost security here. But without the ID cards, we can't work. Suspect is still in police custody as investigations continue. Reporting for Joy News, Erastus Asaridonko, Pakoso, Ashanti Region.